Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs and today we are taking Gage through the Roguelands Gauntlet. Now I have something to show you guys. I've been on the Python SDK mods page and I found a mod that is called Keep Anarchy by Sample Text 282. And it lets you keep a self set percentage of your anarchy stacks on save quit. This does not work in co-op. This should be a really, really good fix. And I've set the percentage to 100%. A really good fix to what makes Gage a little bit you know, annoying to play. I don't think she's even weak, but annoying to play in Roguelands. Let's get out there and see what we can do. We got our Mechromancer. We're going to try to get out there and let Death Trap tank up the Dragon's Force. But now that we have hopefully access to Anarchy that... that continues beyond just the first tier and the second tier and you have to keep restacking it now hopefully anarchy can just be a way more fun mechanic for us to go with a barking snyder is a great get early on here turtle shield the throne grenade it's got 1.9 second fuse time i guess it shouldn't be too bad a tdr for slagging purposes a tdr for launcher purposes and an apparatus i mean it's it's accuracy at the very least all right, sick. Let's do this. Max health plus 50%. That's not bad. Shield capacity plus 33%. I think that's overall better. And second win uh, HP, not the best. So we're on to gauge. We've gotten our win on Maya, our win on Axed, and, and we're trying to get all the wins oh, in order. Right, so if we lose, it starts over. But I found this mod. I was like, I really want to try out Maya. I might as well try it out here. And now, I think right here, we should go with stockpile relic extra sniper max ammo all right so if we look over our inventory to start out here we have a barking snider in slot one we're going to go for a launcher in slot four we have a lots of snipers but we have a sniper for every occasion to be honest with you so why don't we just do that sniper for every occasion and we have bonus sniper max ammo that will hopefully keep our ammo from running out i can land a crit that'd be great Maybe I don't even need a crit. I mean, it is a Snyder. Death Trap doing what Death Trap does. Later, kid. Let me get one of them crits. There we go. That's a nice crit. Let's see, we got Adaptive Shield, Adaptive Shield, Melee Shield, and a Booster Shield. Okay. Ruthless Bully Mong. Maybe I should throw a grenade here. I got It's got a pretty short fuse time. Death Trap's going to be gone soon-ish. I need to do is land a crit or two. Sniper's not doing so much to these guys. Ow, you're gone. Ow. No crit there. Yeah, their, their little crit spots are a little bit challenging to hit. There we go. I feel like that should have been a crit. We, we could use a Jolt's Candy here, which will give our grenades a lot more potency. But I'm going to save it. Yeah, my, my magazine size is so small. My, my fire rate's a little bit higher. That's gotta, that must be due to my class mod that I picked up that gives me fire rate and minus magazine size. I mean, maybe we would like to get a different weapon or a different class mod. Okay. Do I think any of these are worth swapping out one of my snipers for? I don't think so. I don't think so. So we have a... Standard fleshy enemy here. It's just it's just it's just sadness that that doesn't crit. Let's look at the kill though. Let's go over to my shock weapon here. Oh, that was pretty good. That's not bad at all. What if I just take one shot and then unscope? Will that stop the burst? Hmm, not so sure. I, haven't, I feel like I didn't get a, I have I didn't have a guaranteed shot there. Take one shot and stop the burst. Yeah, right. Just like do that. Just unscope every time you shoot with a doll sniper. If you're just trying to take one shots, right? Or you can drag down. I feel like this is a good way to save ammo. You know. I have reload on star for the purposes of never reloading on accident. Need one more kill. That's it right there. Perfect. So now what we do 
right away here in my opinion let's get a synergy out here as well it's a flat off barrel synergy 313,000 damage the fire rate of 6.5 i think that could do something for us but what we do now is we immediately start stacking anarchy so smart lighter faster already has some points into it which means i can actually start i think probably go close enough all right we'll go back for the jolts candy for next round but what we're trying to do is stack up our anarchy as much as we can by reloading. This is going to be a better launcher, I think, than my current. We'll take it. Yeah, we're just trying to blow stuff up, shoot things, and reload. And we have to have our eyes out for a Jacob's shotgun. That's going to be our best um, stacking weapon for anarchy. It's a, a TDR shotgun. The magazine size is eight. It consumes two ammo per shot. It takes four shots. To clear. This diversification. Single barrel. Single barrel is actually kind of nice for Hyperion shotties. Right, let's see here. A policy. It's a Hyperion sniper. My Snyder should be better, but I feel like the Snyder was not putting out the deeps. Bullet Mungs are tanky, but I thought, man, man, like, should have been doing some more deeps with it. All right. Corrosive Cloud is definitely something I'm interested in, even if it does have the fuse time of a jar of mayonnaise. Let's see. Shield capacity plus 34%. We'll take it. We're taking a lot of things here, but... All right, let's go back for the Jolts candy. Make sure our grenade is something that we actually we're, we're proud to throw. A Tesla is a little bit more versatile. All right, next stage. Three, two, one. Our journey through the Rogue Lance has officially begun. Okay, Teslas are going to be better against these enemies than anything else that I can think of. Just run through as fast as we can while we have our jolts candy up. And toss some, toss some grenades here. Hopefully this door opens. I actually never tried to push this stage this fast. It doesn't look like it actually does, which is sadness in the heart. What, these enemies just don't, just don't spawn in? I mean, that's a lot of jolts candy time. Down. Okay, here we go. I hear the door opening now. We're still gonna we're still going to use uh, grenades first. I should have spawned in that trap earlier here. What a whiff. Okay. Probably should have spawned in that trap a little bit earlier, but it is what it is. It's an animosity pistol. A bandit pistol for slagging purposes could be good, but I kinda wanna use this apparatus a little bit. It's all assault rifle. Doesn't look like it's gonna be that high damage. I'll take a convergence. Hey. What are you doing? We officially have five stacks of anarchy. I would have lost all my stacks right there because I, I hit R to reload. This is why we do it this way. Let's also Grenage here. I don't want to go down. Let's just start damaging everybody in an area of effect. Here we go. As a Borderlands, as a Vault Hunter, you are a, a very versatile mage of sorts, you know? Every character has mage-like tendencies. You have grenades. Those are literally spells. You're a wizard, Harry. I'm a what? Harry, you are a wizard. My 41% cooldown is actually kind of big to get. I'll come back for that candy again. Anybody around? Somebody down there, but I, I kind of want to go far. Oh, oh, you are not on the mini map there, my friend. There we go. 17 stacks of anarchy, and it should persist through the tears. Alright, Widowmaker does sound okay, but we're going to start getting our anarchy to the point where we can only use, like, very specific weapons. The... The Hot Mama Sniper Rifle is something that we're going to definitely want. Rumor has it that... That weapon always fires with perfect accuracy, regardless of your accuracy stat. And what gauges anarchy does is it affects your base accuracy stat. Okay, very nice. Thank you, Death Trap. High five. Yes, a Jacob's shotgun. A bushwhack. I can use this bushwhack to stack up very quickly. Let's take a look at the parts on this bad boy. Okay, it's a matching grip Hyperion stock with a vertical foregrip. Uh, the, although, I do think that's the TDR one. But overall, I think this is going to be a really good shotgun for us. It's going to be 
Wow, whatever three, whatever three times 17 is. Three times 17 is 51. So 5.1 million damage. If I'm calculating that correctly. I believe I am. My arithmetic is getting a little bit better as I've gone and played the randomizer and things like that. Close enough. And I think it makes a lot of sense right now. Smart letter faster does as well. So now we're going to have a lot of reload speed. And if we can find a specific kind of chest, we can get max anarchy stacks right now. It's our first transfusion. We don't... Oh, a homing slag bouncing betty. Now that sounds really, really nice. I believe we still have a candy at the front. We don't forget about that. Oi, oi, oi. The only thing I would take over this bushwhack is like a quad or something. I'm in development. So when I pick this up, just for a test, it says 12 there. When I pick this up, how many does it have in my hand? Eight. Okay. That makes sense. I'm not going to take this SMG. It's a doll, unfortunately. Let's see. Leather rifle. The torment. We'll take it. Because we're going to need options for different kinds of raid bosses, so. As of right now, if we fought, if we were to fight Pirate Pete right at this moment, we'd probably get get worked. All right, toss some bouncing Bettys. Get get our slag on. Go over here. Not bad. And it's that one shot reload because of the gauge skills. I've got a three round magazine and a, and a bushwhack. Boom. And in return, I get fire rate and I get unfortunately. Can I get some class mods by the way? Oh my, Lanta, what a call out. Okay, I'm going to take shield capacity. And yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm going to take. Because now I can shoot this thing twice, which is actually a lot better in combat. A lot better in combat, to be honest. Oh, yeah. A little bit slower at stacking, but I can always put that other... Class my back on. All right, Skag's spawning in, in this slag pool. What an addition to the game slag was. After playing Borderlands 1 and you come back here and you just look at this pool and you're like, wow, remember what they used to be? Hey, can you guys come over here, please? I'll take a troublemaker. What's up, lads? Oh, loot skag, perfect. Oh, and a candy. Let's see, a Thunderball Fist legendary pistol. You know what? I think that that could be something good for us. Thunderball Fist. It's a weapon that I haven't used that much that other people seem to like to use. So we'll, t we'll do that. I'm going to keep this B -b 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 TDR SMG. And Fancy Mathematics improves your shield recharge delay and shield recharge rate based on how low your health is. The lower your health, the greater the bonus. That's actually pretty nice. I'm going to do the backup as well. And let's go. I want to get down to typecast iconoclast i'm not gonna take blood soak shields this time all right let's pressure plate this up Ooh, a little two times two pistol here fire is really slow though a times two apparatus now that's something right there how much damage does my thunderball fist do though the apparatus does have a much faster fire rate Hmm. The damage is higher, the fire rate is higher. The magazine size is higher. Overall, you would expect it to be a higher DPS weapon. But I need to give the Thunderball Fist its time to shine. It's going to drop as a first legendary in a very early... Oh my. Atlanta Neo Generator me. All right, it's time to pivot. I think it's time to pivot my... Well, no, you actually kind of want stuff that's good. You want the Neo Generator to be up and running a lot. That's insane good luck. Really good luck to get a, a Neo Generator this early on. Okay. One more red chest, then we can head on out. Presence. I do like the I do like those kinds of SMGs, but we're gonna run past them for now. What kind of ammunition three, two? What kind of my class one that gave me ammo, what was it? it was snipers and something else, right? Let's go Thunderball Fist to see how it does. Oh, Death Trap, I need your help. And let's go ahead and toss some nades to get some slack going. That way I know it's not my fault. 
I, I don't understand where the damage from this is coming from, to be honest with you. I, I, I just don't understand, like, how I'm not doing damage with it when other, other people think it's good. When I could just run, you know, a little bit of elemental matching. Oh, ouch. Bow. Get hit. My shield should be up most of the time, to be honest. All right, class mods, perfect. Plus five wires don't talk. Since something like that, I think could could go really well. Go, plus gun damage, yes. I kind of want something like this, where I just go for some gun damage, forty eight percent, and maybe I just forget about everything else and just run this quad. I don't know. It's not a quad; it's a bushwhack. But an overkill could be. Oh my gosh, we're getting so lucky. Let's go. Little Maggie action. Beautiful. Beautiful. We're gonna be all Jacob's out here. Nothing can stop us. We're all Jacob's out. Actually, we need to stay down here for a couple reasons. One, you. One, the world. <laughs> I, I gotta shoot that banjo, and I do want to get this chest down here. Is there anything to shoot around me? Yes. Destroy you. Get a reload off. And the electric chair grenade. Man, we are just getting... I don't know what's going on with the loot right now, but I feel like we're getting a lot of great stuff. I could have just looked over a... I can always stop back here at the end of this round. I could have just looked over a transfusion grenade, but I don't think any of those are. Electric chairs are perfect. A perfect... per lesson to get for gauge, because I'm a shock damage character, and it's a shock damage grenade. I don't have wires on talk yet, but I will. I would spike a lot. And it's fuse time isn't bad either. Thank you. All right, last banjo's over here. I really hope that Spiko will be around. Oh, Mr. Spiko. He does like to roam around though. All right, super size shield. I'm gonna stick with the Neo Generator. Its stats are gonna look lower than other shields, which is gonna make. There's Spiko right there. Check out this toss. I don't tag him, but I think I think he's still triggered. Yep, he's triggered. In all the right ways. Excuse me, Mr. Spiko. I don't want you to jump on me. We're, we're rocking Maggie. There we go. You want you to drop me? A rock salt. You know, the rock salt is a shotgun that... This is a double barreled. I'm not sure if they're all double barreled. But the Rock Salt is a weapon that is really good with the randomizer, and I kind of want to give it its time. I think it's because because it's high pellet damage. Something weird going on here. Plus six fires don't talk, we take that. Something weird going on with the shotgun. Consumes two ammo per shot. I think it's take six yeah, six shots for it to fully empty. Making it pretty much off the rip worse than, I would say, just the bushwhack, at least on gauge, but... I definitely gonna want to hit up this... This electrical barrier. One more red chest can make all the difference, as we've seen already. La-da-dee, la da doo la da dum da dum dum Dang it. <laughs> Speaking of dum-dums. Alright. I'm liking this. I mean, I think we've got a pretty good shot here gotten a little bit lucky but at the same time we've opened every chest so. we've done our due diligence i uh, fancy mathematics i'm not too sure is worth it or death from above oh nice taking us artful damage one fancy mathematics is what i think it's over here somewhere right or fancy mathematics i don't think it gives me anything that good Whoever it do be. Is it all the way over here to the left? Yeah, fancy mathematics. It's it's actually it's not so bad. It really isn't bad. I can swap out to that one. And I don't think there's a problem. Better gun damage, more weapon accuracy. There we go. Okay. Let's take our five. I think it's time to try to get down to typecast iconoclast. We go and we got more chances to stack more anarchy and with close enough i feel confident that we can push through this um 
What's going to be our weapon of choice for this? I think we're going to go... We might turn this into a, like a, a stacking session for me. Let's go shotgun on the small... Shotting the small map just for a little bit. Just, just to get some stacks up. Maybe. I can go to a Maggie for long range weapon... Weaponry. And a Anarchy in general is a really just nice way to get good damage off. Whoa! Ow, 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 ow. Hey, let's, uh, let's stack up a little bit here. Thank you. Because right now, my, my max stack count is ridiculous. Okay, let's go back to the main effort. Pretty good damage. Actually, it's really good. I shouldn't I shouldn't be saying pretty good. It's really good. I mean, it is tier 1, but my, my damage goes up and up. I am Gage. Once I get myself like a, a powerful launcher like that, I can end these rounds very quickly. I'm like, do you want some launcher? It's really not bad at all. Uh, let's, let's stack up a couple more times here. Use our sh shoddy in this moment. I think we keep keep farming this guy up for stacks just for a little bit. Just got to be careful not to miss or do anything stupid. Uh, this guy should be gone over there. Okay, do you got any minions? Do you spawn in more laddies or no? Yeah, you do. Sick. I'm not sure when we're going to stop stacking, but I would kind of like these stacks now, just in case I don't get the, the right stage to keep stacking later on. Bum, 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 bum. Setting ourselves up for the future. We also could go infinite, apparently. Okay, let's give him one more shot. I don't know how much we want our stacks to go up, to be honest with you. I don't know how much is too much. I like to think that <laughs> there is no too much, but I'm not too sure. I, you can also, I think, I, this might be a good way to get some loot enemies, to be honest with you. Is there an easy way to just avoid this? You just gotta, you just have to stand over to the side of it? I think so. Yeah, because I think strafing is just like OP against this guy. Alright, I'm done stacking. Let's just take him out. 127. This is a really good chance for us to get some good class mods. Alright, magic missile, that, that's exactly what we're looking for. Trespasser, perfect. A hail, couldn't ask for a better slate of weapons. Let's go ahead and restructure our inventory a little bit to have some fun. The hail is coming in here, and if we do end up in a situation where we want to use the hail, which this hail is kind of a little bit weird. The hail is better against robots and bigger enemies, whereas the fire isn't, so it's kind of a weird thing I got going on right there, but... Uh, that times two umbrage is looking juicy. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it's going to be... Uh, it's going to be toothpick. We are looking juiced. This is tier one, by the way. Tier one is usually when you're like trying to figure out like how am I going to kill a raid boss? I mean, I'm still thinking that. But at the same time... I'm also thinking right now, like, as long as we get Terramorphous, this could be a very, very efficient run. I think the nth degree is important. I think Death from Above actually makes a little bit of sense. Consume some Anarchy, or do we, or do we rather do Discord? Right, because now that we have a toothpick, we kind of don't want as much anarchy stacks. But we could do the same thing just by jumping. Right? We cash in our we cash in extra damage. Okay. And now that we have that, I kinda wanna get Death Trap out here for longer. Or do I go more into the skill tree and take things like I don't know, blood soak shields? Let's give Death Trap a little bit of a smack. I'll take Blood Soak Shields. I want to get down to the nth degree for more ricochets when we head on out. So now I can jump and reduce my Anarchy stacks if I'm feeling like, whoa, like, I remember the last time actually I specifically used the Toothpick. And I just had no accuracy, and I was like, this is, this is actually kind of lame. All right, so we got more pep here, and what else do we get? Tomorrow, letter faster. Cool. 
Okay, let's get that trap out of here. Magic missile. I know my tyrant's gonna cause me problems. I can already tell. Very nice. Very nice. Very good. I gotta get a little bit closer up and kind of treat this, I think, like a shotgun. There we go. Now that we... I mean, this weapon is a 1A. This is an alpha, you know, this is a... It's 700,000 damage times 2. But it's all the projectiles split. And it's un... un what's it called? Unlabeled projectiles. So I think they all get B-Shield scaling. So if I can get a, a B-Pick going on... The downside of this is the ammo consumption. But... We can loot ammo. Not a big deal. Okay. Oh, wow, things are slagged up here. That's sick. What's up, Goliath? Later. Okay, do, am I getting flanked at all? Look at the damage now on this youth pick. It's kind of crazy. Very nice. Very nice. Yep. We are looking very, very nice. And if, I, if I'm in an area where I'm like, oh, shoot, like, I, I really don't think this is going to be good for me to be so inaccurate... Well, then, I can... I can just jump and get rid of some of my Anarchy stacks. Cool. Um, the, I actually don't know where the pressure plate is in this map. Unless it's over here. No, this is where the vault symbol is. What do you got for me? Max health. That's lame. I, I honestly do not remember ever finding it on this map in particular. Unless it's like... I thought it might be like... Back here or something. No, maybe not. Okay. Don't think I see anything there. I mean, we're already starting to get a little bit geared now. So, you don't have to be so picky about looking at every single chest. Like, we have a toothpick. It's really, really strong. This is a perfect area to have the toothpick. Perfect area. There we go. That's going to be the toughest enemy we fight here. Those gallant spider ants, so. The fact that one of them's already gone without having to actually hit its weak spot is kind of insane. Oh, I did a jump shot right there. That was pretty sick. Jump shot. Wait, hold on. Jump shot. Boom. Let's go. That's awesome. A oh, blazing spider ant. Let's see if it can survive my full damage build. <laughs> Probably not. That's just how crazy it is, though. Honestly. Later, kid. Okay. Let's go grab our pressure plate. Also, take our five points. Nth degree is finally maxed out. I think now I will take the better half. I want more fire rate. More damage. Or favor. If flying SMG might be the only thing that we can use to take out a raid boss at this point. Oi, oi. Let's see, what do we get? It looks like a Jeruk. It's a Brachny. Hey, I feel good. I feel strong. If Max. Nope, we roll. Oof. This tier one is something else. Let me tell you that. I'll tell you that much. Tier one, you never know what could happen. Tier one is my, I think, probably my favorite tier of Rogue Lands. Especially when you get something like super sick early on. Because tier one can kill you. That's what I like about it. It can kill you. So when you do get something that's really strong, you, you, you definitely appreciate it. Like, it's like you made this this stage of it a little bit trivial until the enemies get a little bit tankier and start doing more damage. Which I'm okay with. And I'm okay with missing a little bit here too. I just don't want my... I don't want my... Oh, Legendary? Wow, I, particle effects got me. Okay. I think there is a vault symbol over here. I'm doing my part. I'm getting as many of the... Oh, shield recharge rate isn't bad. I'm, I'm getting as many of these... Ladder. Yes. I'm getting as many of these vault symbols as I can to try to get maybe incendiary damage or something like that, but... 
It's just not happening for me. Let's go around here. Look at the pressure plate. There's a fire druke. That is really, really nice. I wish it was any other element. But fire druke is always a welcome sight. Let's take a Vladoff spinny gun. Death trap stay out longer. Unstoppable force is a really good skill too. We're kind of we're branching out into all different kinds of things right now. I kind of like that. I don't I don't like having like an absolute set skill order. I like to kind of branch, get a little bit of everything going. There we go. And treating our toothpick like a shotgun, and we get to fight Oni already, which is it's it's a good thing and it's a bad thing. Oh, loot, loot, loot. Loot, lunatic. Take it out. Take him out. Logan's gun. Okay, we are well on our way to sham fleeting. You've never seen an Oni kill quite like this. Kill the boss. Kill the boss. Oh my gosh, we did it. Now oh, that's an Oni kill right there. Ooh, a splasher blaster. <laughs> a splasher blaster. Okay, so let's go ahead and shoot. I mean, our... Our tools are pretty good, but I still would like a slag transfusion. It's not a bad launcher. It's a little bit more versatile than my current. Let's take it. Okay. Now, I'm not... What I'm not going to do is I'm... Unfortunately, I'm not going back there to those two chests. Too risky with the super speed. Too risky. That one death in the top right corner? Where do you think that one death came from? Let's take this bandit launcher for the, for, for the time being. Okay, what do we got? A slag transfusion, mayhaps? No. Okay. We roll on. Oh, I've, I've unclaimed loot. Let me go ahead and check my rewards first. It's actually a not a bad class mod. Slap that bad boy on. It's still more pep, which I don't have any points in, but now it's more points in the better half, which gives me more fire in the back half of my skills. Gold candy? Yep. All right, toss me. All right, time for the magic missiles to, to shrut their stuff here. Have some fun with it. Rogue Lance is about having fun. Oh, another Jolt candy. Um, You know what I'll do? I'll do this. I will pop back to the electric chair. Grab Jolt candy and go, 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 Power Rangers. We've got five, five skill points to put in. All right, you kill him. Thank you. I would like to get a kill, please, so I can get some more movement speed. Thank you. Yes, you spawned. It spawned. Nade spam. While we have Joel's candy. Yeah, we actually got a lot of grenades off with Joel's candy up. And that's just how it's done. Oh, excuse me. Okay, what do we get? A trespasser, I have one already. A little EV is good, and a share of May is good for healing and slag -ing potential. The Jacob shotgun can come back to us if we need to be stacking. A homing slag transfusion with a 0.5 second fuse time is not amazing because of the homing aspect, but the 0.5 second fuse time aspect is quite amazing. Okay. Let's go ahead and do the better half. Unstoppable force. Cook, not taking cooking up trouble. It's just, it's, I'm, I literally am cooking up trouble, but I want more death trap. Give me a copy of my shield of death trap doesn't really make any sense. Let's see. Wires don't talk plus six is really good. So we'll take it. I understand that you can give him like a love thumper or something, and like that'll that'll do that'll do some some juice for you. But okay, goodbye, friends. Make sure that loot dwarf miner dies. I should have dropped. He should have dropped a legendary. What did I get? I got a a, a corrosive Lyud Miller. That's a really, really, really big get. Really, 
really big get. And let's get our Iridium now. Our arsenal is already coming together. Like, it's already coming together. And it, I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty much there. Now, we can focus on getting SDUs instead of hitting the box so much. Okay, I'm going to do Mylan here. And we continue on. To Sanctuary, we go. Now we must face our foe. All right. In honor of being back on the Rogue Lands, pow, I'll shoot it one time for the one time. Okay. Now you're going to give me a Topnia. Oh, I really thought for a second. Okay, so. Assault Rifle for the Toothpick. Sniper for Lyud Mila. Shotgun. Launcher. I'm going all the way. I'm going to go for that many launcher. Okay. Your powder, let's get at her. Come on now. Terramorphous. Okay, Terramorphous. Great matchup for us. Great matchup. I think we should go ahead and slap on a homing slag transfusion. Couldn't have asked for a better starting matchup. And we're going to get to see whether or not the mod to maintain my stacks works. I'm at 253 stacks. All right, Tara. That's nice shield, buddy. Oh, this is going to be a quick one. We are geared to the gills for this fight. Oh, he slagged. GG. Oh, it's a one shot. Let's go. You don't really get to see him slag that much. All right, overcompensator. It's a lot of nice loot. Cradle. Okay. I, I mean, when I said nice loot, I didn't mean that. Um, Big boom blaster before infection, probably. The infection is low damage, low fire rate. It's not that great. You can apply dots at a high rate, but like, what's the point? It's not like I have extra corrosive damage for anything. Maybe if I was going like a dot build. Like a dot build for Krieg or something. Get out of base? No way. Alright, hopefully this isn't the alternate version. It looks like it is the alternate version. So I'm lost. I'm stuck. I'm scared. Okay, you just don't laugh at me as I try this, okay? That's all I ask. It can't be this easy. No, we're going to have to go around. It's a trick. It's not a trick. Wow. <laughs> what a maze. What a maze. Turns out you just don't take any turns at all. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Okay. Let's pop, pop a lock of polka dot it and we have our stacks. Ladies and gentlemen, we have our stacks. That's big. That's large. Okay. What's that line? Hello, hello. What happened over here? I had a rumor about rare loot enemies roaming the roguelands. I've never actually seen one, though. Oh, that's cool. You must not be out there in the roguelands that often. <laughs> okay. Jump me. Jump me. Jump me. Hey, we're there. Hop, skip, and a jump me. All right, we're going. Sawtooth Cauldron. The Cauldron of the Sawtooth Sawtooth Cauldron. <laughs> the Toothpick isn't the best weapon for this zone. So why don't we lower my... I'll lower my... Okay, we immediately get greeted with, like, insanely strong enemies. Let's... I think we'll be better off using a magic missile here. And just doing jump shots. Just jump shots. It'll lower my anarchy a little bit, but I'm going to manage that. I'm going to manage that with my jump shots. Okay, jump shot me. Go. So I'm getting stacks up pretty quickly. He doesn't resist to the head. But hitting headshots is, is a task. Okay, toss a couple of these nades. I might do. Oh, Nomad Plunder, you're gone. 
Let me kill the Goliath in time. Let's go. Heavy Nomad. This guy's got to go. 1v1 me, bro. I'm a little bit inaccurate. He did get a good shot off on me. My shield comes up basically instantly. When I'm low HP. When I get one shot, my shield comes back. Very fast. Okay, I kind of want to take out this guy in the sky. Nice, nice. We do get a Jolt Candy we can use. Can I see anybody from here? Oh, my Atlanta. Let's not mess around at all. Please. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. We're so back. Imagine we died there. I have no accuracy. I thought when I jump shot, it cost me uh, anarchy stacks. Am I crazy? Oh, we got a spitter, though. That's pretty sick. Okay, so let's take Mylin into stair into more pep. I thought when I landed jump shots because of this skill. Oh, but the anarchy stacks consumes only one because only have one point in it because it's not the full version. Got it. Right, let's go next stage. Take. Okay, okay. Here's what we do. We're going to put the toothpick in the back pocket for now. We're going to bring up the Lyud Milla. Next, we're going to swap our class mod to something that is, it's just, it's just good to the bone. Damage. And we're going to go for some jump shots here as well. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We don't even have Death Trap out there yet. Yeah, we're one-shotting ultimate badasses. Yeah, we're just going to lower my anarchy just a little bit. Just a little bit. I don't want it too high. Too high is how you die. Do a little bit of jump shot action. Maintain it around this. I kind of like it around this, you know, 200 mark, 210 mark, I guess. I guess I could just cap it out. Something I, I would consider doing. Okay. Obviously, the light middle is just, an, uh, just a beast. Oh, TD or damage. That's great to get. Okay. I, I can't see the skills because Death Trap is, is, a, is a really large lad. Let's just turn this way. <laughs> All right, more pep. Shock and awe. I think... We might as well take Shock Storm. I really don't know if it's going to be any good, but... Right, let's hop right here. See if we can get ourselves... Ah... You can get some really good relics, especially mouthwash, because mouthwash pairs with toothpick and makes it a lot stronger. Okay, let's go to our Maggie. It should be strong enough here. Whoa, chill out there. Chill out there, guys. Okay, rabbit's gag. This isn't good. I'm being a little bit lazy and not swapping back to my toothpick. And we're going to go assault rifle gun damage. Ow, if I get hit once more, I go down. Ah, that sucks. Oh, second win. Thanks, Death Trap. That's cool how it says that. Here we go. There's no vault symbols on this map, unfortunately. Oh, two candies. I can only take one with me. All right, then I'll take the Pyrex candy with me. Emergen and Fire Rate. To go shoot down some skags over here. I'll take the bonus projectiles into next round. Pretty sick, huh? I like that. Okay, let's open up some open up some loot. I just want to see because now that we have super speed after round end, we can just go around to these chests and just open them up one by one. We can have one by one. Let's take our points. All right, wires don't talk now. For when we want to do shock stuff and then interspersed outburst is next. Don't play games with my with me like that. Back to the toothpick. This is much more better. Much more better. I wonder what the final skill is for that class mod. This one right here. More pep in the better half. I'm sure there's, there's always the third one, right? Okay. 
Now we can take this um, Juicos? No, Mopey's Candy. Into this stage where we're gonna... Oh, yeah, we're gonna one-shot this guy. There we go. And where's the small guy? There you go, you're gone. Extra projectiles goes crazy. Crazy here. Hey, what did you drop me, though? I don't see a unique. Makes me sad. I might as well. We always get that trap back each round anyway. Very sick. Thanks, that trap. Appreciate you. Give me, give me that sound cue as to where that guy was. Oh, here it is. A twister. Would you look at that? That's really, really good. It's a great get. It's a really good weapon for me. The accuracy doesn't matter as much. And it's shock damage. And I'm, and I'm juicing up shock stuff. That's that's what I'm doing. So what I always do is B, you know what I'm saying? Okay, here, it's the better half and smaller, later, faster. Actually, that's much better. If we're doing talking toothpick, it's the better half and smaller, later, faster. I think this is better, even though it's 3% less gun damage. And let's take our five, interspersed, outburst. Okay, finally a launcher that's that's what I'm about what I'm looking for. There we go. Uh do I need to I don't think I need to hit up the the shovels. I think I'm good to just head out. I'm getting a little bit greedy here, but I think I can. All right, layer of infinite agony. A uh, fire is what I'm going to use to retire her. A little bit of death trap out here. I hope that's slagged. Didn't, which is crazy because it is a magic missile. Phase one gone, done, done and dusted. Don't mind me just hanging out inside of her one spell. <laughs> That's not true. She has more than one spell, but still. Feels like one. Are you ever going to go up there? I'm trying to get this fight over with, sister. I'm for real. You're a big fleshy enemy. You don't. It's This isn't it. You guys. In order to beat me right now, I think you're going to need to either send Cromorax or, P or Pirate Pete at me. Or dragons. I think those are your options. I don't think you got other options. Alright, let's shoot you. We've got 304 stacks of anarchy. I feel like all I have to do is hit something, right? Early. And then everything around, including the boss, dies. Hey, don't do that. There we go. Should be juiced. I'm also just shooting, shooting just for ricochets at this point. No loot enemies, though, so far. Which is odd. My accuracy is so bad. Oh, there we go. What is it? It's a hammer buster. That's a great weapon. Let's go. Actually, it might be better for right now. A little bit more accuracy. It's still an assault rifle. Perfect. When I said a little bit more accuracy, I didn't mean, like... <laughs> This tiny little bit of accuracy. All right, let's go. Magic missile. The only thing we don't want her to do is heal up off of our, off of our bones. Oh, my accuracy is so bad. I might have to get. I might have to put a point in Discord. Actually, I don't get any more points. It might have to be a respec angle at some point. Okay, I think I'll take a stink pot, but I'm not gonna take any of these other things. Iridium me. Iridium me. Is that iridium? Was that a purple weapon? Can't tell. Won't tell. <laughs> can't, can't stop. Won't stop. Okay. Let's see how we do here. I'm ready. I'm ready for the... I dare it. I, I honestly dare this... These chests to become... A mimic. I'm actually not going to hit that chest. I, I, I feel like in, throughout all the years of playing... I've never once gotten anything good from this chest. Even when I roll 20s. 19. You open it up and you're like, oh. <laughs> Not worth it when these can have anything in them, right? So. Whiskey Tango Foxtrot or a nasty surprise? You know, I, I'm spoiled for choice. <laughs> the Gulag. Okay, so here, pretty obvious choice. We go Lyudmilla. 
And we're going to go gun damage. And we're going to try to jump around. Jump up, jump up, and get down. You know what I'm saying? You're gone. Jump up, jump up, and get down. Light mill is pretty accurate. It's going to help us in our endeavor here, I think. Good. And we, we maxed out our blammo with it. Before. Later, kiddo. Yep. Oh, here you are. Beat him. Yeah, nice. Okay, good. More chances at some good relics here. Pistol damage plus 33%. Finally. Something I can hang my hat on. Decent relic for your boy. So we have a fire droog and a corrosive light mila. Now all we need is a shock something. Ooh, there's a quad. A matching grip quad. I think, right? No. That I think that's the TDR grip. That's unlucky. I'm pretty sure the TDR grip's like the worst one. There's a quad, though. I like that. I'm gonna stick with my bushwhack. Okay. Talk to talk to me. Talk to me. Another Captain Blades auto idol. The auto idol is nice. In fact, in Borderlands 3, it's one of the ones that I used on Moe's for a long time. But cutting my fight for lifetime is not is not something that I have any interest in. Okay. Thousand cuts. Let's roll. Um, I th think I can get away with just doing some jump shots here. And lowering my stacks up a little bit. 301. 290, 297. Uh, yeah, let's just do some jump shots for a bit. Lower my damage a little bit. A little bit. At the same time, increase our accuracy. Because we do need a little bit of accuracy. Bone Crusher. Okay. I think I can... Can I can I make you a certain element? Or do not, I don't have the capstone yet or something. Oh, get juked. That was funny. These guys are fast. We go 271. I can, I can actually just honestly switch to light melee here. Probably It'd be much faster. Yep. 250. That's good. Very nice. Very nice. See, I can, I can regulate it a little bit. I think we're good. I think that this, these skill points can get us there, hopefully. And I didn't, I didn't take Blood Soak Shields, which... Blood Soak Shields is a bad skill to take if you're trying to kill Ancient Dragons. This is a kill skill, I think. Yeah, that lowers your own health. Don't want that. Okay. Whoa, whoa, if I didn't get, if, I, if that didn't cancel my momentum, I probably would have jumped off the edge there. All right, let's head out. Sawtooth Cauldron again. This is one of the hardest zones. I'm not too excited to be fighting here, to be honest with you. Ow. And okay, you're gone. Magic must for these guys a little bit. Burst stacks low. Low and slow. Just look at the... If we can get ourselves a hot mama or something, like, I'm down to go, you know, a million stacks. Or, like, a, a North Fleet with a Sham Shield or something. Yeah, I'm down to go, like, three million and a half stacks. Besides that, not really. Ooh, these are tough rounds. Not gonna lie to you. Tough rounds. Let's go next. South boss team of power again. Okay. These are the mini bosses I'm gonna get, and then these are the mini bosses I'm gonna get. Right, let's go. I'm not gonna worry about the grenades and shields. Don't die here, though. He's about to get a burst off, I think. Yep. Okay, I think I might want to swap over to a... 
electric chair here. I do have wires don't talk. It's gonna help me out in this endeavor. Okay. I think everybody should be zapped up now. That guy's somehow surviving though. Okay, bring it down. Yeah, they, they don't live through that. No way. No way, Jose. A fireball grenade. No thanks. I will take this. Hey, a Dobby Droog. <laughs> Would you look at that? Sick. Now we have snipers for all kinds of raid bosses. No more points, though. That's so, that's so sad. My skill, my skill tree is... I'm getting all of the fire bosses. This is crazy talk. Boom, 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 boom. What up, homie? Okay, okay, okay. Wow, 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 wow. He almost, he almost coming right there. And shock is no good against him. I'm happy to have a couple different kinds of grenades, to be honest with you. Boss me. Okay, not bad deeps. Not bad deeps. Please go for death trap and not me. Thank you. Go for death trap and not me. Jerk. Maybe I should go over to the Droog here. Boom, 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 boom. Just dodge all of his attacks, but they never miss, so I don't know how to get away from them. Oh, that's a great, that's a, uh, that's perfect for me. Hey. Rude. Oh my gosh, I go down here. Well played, snowman. Well played. Oh, nice miss. Now I win. Turns out maybe all you have to do against the snowman is stand still. I take his hat. Perfect. Sorry, homie. Boom, 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 ba -da boom, boom, ba boom. Okay, face time. Do we get anything good here? Oh, okay, our first legendary class mod. Smart letter faster, the better half. Looking up trouble. Strength of five gorillas, more pep. I think we do take it for the extra cooldown rate. Maybe, though. Maybe. It's great for cooldown, but not much else. That could be like 49% gun damage is a lot. Then again, it gets it kind of gets less and less as you get more and more anarchy. I have a million trespassers. Just in case I don't have one, I'm taking one. In case I fooled myself into thinking I had one. But we need at least one. Okay. Let's roll. Well, my reward, of course. Yeah, toothpick or a invader. I'm going to take the toothpick in case it does have better stats than mine. Relatively identical, to be honest with you. Less fire rate, I think, is a little bit more interesting to me. Uh-oh. I'm black screened. This isn't good. Okay, wow, that worked. It looks like I, I opened up like a fast travel menu, but it was the screen was completely black. But when I clicked on a spot, it sent me to Oasis and then it sent me back here. I was like, oh, that worked out. I'm gonna do some jump shots here, I think. Well, I mean, raid bosses are kind of big though. Maybe I do want some more stacks now. Depending on which raid boss, I kind of want... I don't know. Okay, 20 out of 25. 25, hey, Pyrrhus, I don't mind having less accuracy, you know what I'm saying? Later, kids. All right, let's take our token of giving. Let's do a, let's do a full clear. Hey, where'd you go? There it is. I always go the other way. Let's go this way this time. 
And I remember why I go the other way, because I need this this finger to do two things at once. Okay. Ooh, a little plasma caster action. I'll take that. That's fun. The chest that the builders rejected has become the corner chest. Assault rifle damage plus 31%. Although gun damage bonuses on Gage are not as good as on other characters. Really? I mean, this, don't get me wrong. The sniper rifle max ammo is what we are going to be going into the next fight with. But still. Alright, talk to me. Launcher? Yes, 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 yes. Ooh, and a carnage too. Yeah, a nuke him could go pretty hard. Not gonna lie to you. Let's do another pull. Invader. And a, a twin hornet. That's actually a really nice get. Okay, an ogre. I do like an ogre. An infection cleaner. Okay. Let's go ahead. And stock up on some blammo types. Okay. Before we go into the next stage, let me make sure that I put on the sniper rifle max ammo. The sniper rifles are probably going to be my number one source of damage in this fight. We actually managed to not go against... Oh my goodness. We managed to not go against... Pyropy or Cromorax. So all that worrying I did about having a, like the right shock weapons... Didn't matter at all. Ow, 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 ow. Don't go down, don't go down, don't go down. Okay. Fire. Fire. I need to hit him. I don't have that much time. Oh, yeah. Man, I'm missing. Let's okay, He's got to go around the go around the gauntlet one more time. Okay, they, they resist slag, but they don't resist corrosive, which is nice. Good. I am jumping, lowering my anarchy stacks a little bit, but I don't think I need that many. To do what I'm trying to do here. Okay, one more robot. There we go. Come on, do some deep stone. That's not hurt. That's not hurting him. I just, I, I, I feel like it should be hurting him. Either way, we are still getting the job done. Run, running, running, and running, running. Reload me. Don't get hit, don't get hit, don't get hit, don't get hit. Good. Feel like these are hitting him. That definitely hit him. That definitely... He did not like that. Yes. There we go. That's a nice kill. Wasn't entirely clean. Wasn't perfect. But it was a good kill. Really good kill. Hey, that's a nice SMG to get. Really accurate for headshots. Big boom blaster. I have it. What's going to be my... Hoplite? <laughs> no meme is a decent... Is a decent shield. Uh, for dragon fight. If you kill the shock dragon first, and you just go hoplite, yeah, I think, I really do think it's kind of an insane shield. Okay. Let's go then. Open up. Open up, open up. Bushwhack. Yeah, blade on it. I don't trust it as much. Okay, I think it's time for us to head to tier three. An hour and four minutes in, we're not making the fast. It's not the f absolute fastest time, but it's definitely not the slowest time. Let's launch her away, shall we? So this is the weird one. The one I don't know where everything is. Jump me on top of here. Easy. This was the one I don't know exactly where it's at. Is 
Is it because I gotta shoot? Yeah, you gotta shoot Pete's eye or something. It's something weird, but I know I have close enough on, so I don't really know what it is that causes that. And then I believe this one is just right over here. Not in that corner anymore. I thought it was. I was on top of that pedestal or something. I'd, oh, here we go. Right here. Perfect. Inside this gauntlet. And on to tier three we go. This is when we can start getting ourselves some real serious loot. I mean, we already have serious loot, but I'm talking like really serious loot. Where we start getting access to gear that you might be putting into like as everything as if it's your final build, you know? Okay. Right, chest me. We didn't even get a chance to like use the Thunderball Fist against uh, a raid boss. That's that's what I was gonna do with it. Oh, that's not good. I spawned <laughs> out in the middle of the open. With no enemies around. That's fine. Bring it on, Skags. The game might be bugged, but hey. That don't matter to me. Catch. Hopefully it fixes itself by next round. And this, this is just like a weird spawn. I know how to kill enemies in Borderlands. I'm... I know Slouch. Bought some jolts candies to kill some of these guys up, up top. You look if you want to kill some skags, find some skags dens. And right now, what I'm looking to do is kill skags. Because my the toothpick is best, probably against skags. There's a rabbit. I'm just shocked that this thing isn't doing more than that to that guy. I could be in trouble here. No, but I'm fine. I could probably stack up a little bit more. I'm trying to land any jump shots if I can help it. It is cool kind of fighting out in the open though in the same Rogueland style environment. To be honest with you. Kind of like the idea. Get stabbed. You got there, you and I death trap. Let's go find ourselves three more enemies. I know where to find some. Over by Doc Mercy. And yeah, we could go Hammer Buster here. I think it might be a little bit better, but. Okay, and I should probably slap on my assault rifle stuff. Just fire as if I know what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, almost there. Come on now. I really hope the spawns aren't busted. Okay. Let's go. Of course, I need to collect my reward first. Okay, not. Come on. Don't break. Okay, this is a proper spawn. Happy about that. But I'm not too sure the enemies are. Good night. Oh yeah, now we're talking. Now we don't have Hyperus just ignoring everything I do. Boom! Later, kid. Yes, it doesn't matter if I'm accurate with this bad boy. What's well, a scavenger? I almost killed- I almost one shot a scavenger. That's big. Any other questions? Yeah, where do you get off? I killing buzzers, brother. Whoa, you're stuck on the wall. Oh, it's an, it's a regular enemy. Here, catch. There, kid. <laughs> I don't even have to kill that buzzer. Do you know why? I'm too good for that. Oh gosh, what a whiff! I have a big boom blaster. I could always switch to. I got a feeling we're going to see some more buzzards. 
Da 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 Sorry about that. <laughs> love Thumper or Deadly Bloom? I think the Love Thumper could be kind of cool to put on to help Death Trap out. So he can run around and, and do some big deeps. I should be... I, I, I don't know why I'm skipping through these zones. I should definitely not be doing that. Alright, I think this is a normal spawn as well. Odds of me hitting that turret? Pretty low. Odds of the ricochet is hitting that turret? Decently high. Like I said, if all you gotta do is switch to this light Milla, and I still have the, the assault rifle stuff on. You know what I'm saying? Like, light Milla is insanely good. Those are helpful buzzards. Boom. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Luckily, these guys have armor, which is really helpful, actually. Where are the enemy buzzers? Oh, it's buzzer right there. Oh, it's a jet loader. Got it. Oh, he took the full wrath of that magazine. There was no holding back there. There's no holding back here either. Later. Yeah, this light Miller might be the way. Okay. Looks like we we're, we're kind of juiced past that round. Anytime we go up against armored enemies, it's just like swapped light Mila instantly. And it just becomes really easy, to be honest. We have enough anarchy key at this point for the light Mila to really just carry us through those types of situations. Yeah, I'm not seeing any pressure plates or vault symbols anywhere. A nice Snyder, but we're not going to take it. Nervous about getting too close to the edge. Don't push me, cause I am close to the edge. The other, these guys didn't spawn out here, which makes me wonder if. I don't know. They were supposed to, and that's how I don't die. Let's just get off the stage. Of course, I need to collect my reward first. All right, canyon. Okay, this is not a fire damage area. Or this is not a uh, armored area. Clayton. I actually, I am going to shoot all the radios. So I need to, I want to get myself a top near. Okay. Catch. Catch. Thank you. Come again. Perfect. That trap get out here. And fire! No one shot though. That's tough. Wait for him to re wait for him to get his, his juice back up and then we shoot him twice. There we go. Okay. Radio. The radio number two. Clayton, you're around? Hello? Somebody's over here. Oh, that was a decision. He's one hit. Good. Cool. Let's reload while these guys are, are chasing me down. Dead trap hopefully intercepts. He does. I should really start just throw reloading it. I nuke him. Hey, don't want you don't want to join the party? You just want to hide up there? I'm fine. It is what it is. Oh, now you want to join the party. Now you want to chase me. What is this? It's a Spider-Man Brawler? Looks like you're dead. You too. Redonculus. Yeah, Redonculus. I agree, Gage. Oh, hey. Okay, I'm out of launch ammo. That's bad. Let's swap over to a big boom blaster. And what we're gonna do is this. Let this guy torch me up a little bit. Maybe get me to drop some boosters. There we go. There we go. Some more rocket shots. More rocket shots. Thank you. Appreciate that. Not bad. Alright, shoot the last radio. 
I got a couple of those rocket shots back. Got some more of those rocket shots back. And more of them. Huge, 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 huge. Alright, so now... Ooh, Legendary Anarchist I do like. I do like the Legendary Anarchist. So much gun damage. 55%. Although... We're gonna be so inaccurate now. I wonder what my max stack count is as, as of this point. My final radio is behind that wall. Up. Big radio. Alright, top near me. Maloko. Maloko. Blaster. Uh, plasma caster. And a, a slag top near. Would you look at that? Okay, perfect. Let's let's roll out. A dragon keep. Let's go. Let's go big boom blaster as well. Okay. You ready to feel the pain? Welcome to late game gauge builds. Throw reload. See the multiple projectile. See the candy there. I'll go grab it. Ouch, that hurt. That could be in trouble. No, I'm good, I'm good. Eat the candy. Let's just use this bad boy. I think this will be the most accurate way that I can deliver this Mopey's candy. Come on, one more mag, please. Yes, let's go. That's huge. That's huge, huge, huge. All right, where's my where's my juicy loot? Any juicy loot? Don't see any, but this ethereal gift box should be pretty sick. All right, what do we get? An ogre? No, honestly, not the best. I do like ogres though. I'm an ogre kind of guy. All right, let's roll. Let's roll out. Bouncing Betty, or yeah, you know what? A fire bouncing Betty isn't actually the worst thing in the world. <laughs> All right, so here I think we make a uh, we make a very clear decision right off the bat here. We we go to I really don't have the most flexible relics in the world, to be honest. Jacob's magazine size seems pretty good. Okay, let's start off with a little bit of a little bit of. Top Nia. Reload me. Pick up you. Here we go. I don't want to aim it too low because then I could hit myself really easily. You know what I'm saying? Alright, so now we switch over to Lyud Milla. After we destroy this guy, we'll, we'll go to the boss. And by boss, I do mean boss. Just take it out, just like that. That's the best way to do it. Even from the grave, that guy's still trying to kill me. Please give me what I want. Lord of the Seraphs isn't that great. And then what I'm really looking for now, honestly, is a bee shield. If I can get a bee shield, we are... We are going to the moon. I also want to find the pressure plate here. Um, what I might do is I might pause it, and then I'll be right back when I find it. It's just kind of crazy because this isn't a very big area, and yet the pressure plate eludes me. I've searched a lot of different places. I don't think it's along the top wall at all. Oh, <laughs> right here. <laughs> nice. Alright, infection cleaner, high of terramorphous, and what dropped? A saw bar. Okay, it's, I mean, it's not the best. Oh, the bone trader could be cool. It's not the absolute best, you know, series of events, but hey. Can't always get what you ask for. Okay, so we are going to be going pretty much strictly top near here because of how many heavy nomads and things spawn in this area. I don't like how this guy's like directly on top of me. Oh, wait, is this robots? What in the world? It's a juggernaut up there. Okay, death trap. You stay on him. 
Buy me some time. And that's not good. That is not good. Run for my life. Run for my life. Run for my life. Run for my life. I need to get a sham. That's what I need. I ask a life. Perfect. Oh my gosh, I'm back. I'm only, at, only, I'm only at 4 out of 10? What in the world? Let's destroy this guy with our, with our toothpick. There we go. Gotcha. Gotcha. Right, back to my... Not every shot has to hit. Not every shot has to hit. Holy cow. What a stage. What a stage. That is a... That's a very dangerous stage. I'm the I'm a danger to myself though to be honest with you with this top knee I'm running around with. Realistically, it's it's definitely gonna get me killed. It's offering me a lot of damage. Okay, so let's grab the pressure plate and the vault symbol here as well if we can find them. Hey, vault symbol, mouth mouthwash, mouthwash. Nope. We take it, but we're probably not going to end up using it. Now, for the pressure plate, I might have to pause again because I don't know exactly where it is in this map. I'll pause it, and I will be right back. Okay, I found it. So if you go wherever this back corner is, and you find this chest, and you're like, oh, well, it's in the back corner. Here we go. Come on. World burn. Hector's Paradise and a Butcher. Okay, these are some weapons that I can that I can get behind. Let's go ahead and get the Butcher out there. Let's get the World Burn out here instead of this Topnia. And I think... I, wanna, I don't want to jinx anything, but I think we might be cooking with gas. How's this? Hopefully this guy doesn't hit me with his axe. That would hurt a lot. That trap. Get him interested in something else. Okay, let's kill this buzzer. Drop, reload. See ya. This world burn is definitely inaccurate. But it's definitely doing a lot of damage. Boom. Oh, good job, Death Trap. Boom. I got your back up, don't worry. Drop, reload. Where are you? You're shooting from right there. Back up a little bit here. There we go. Get some launch ammo back from that. Drop, reload. Thank you. And let's go up here and get the pressure plate. G shield. Okay, we did get mouthwashed. That's a big get. That's a big get. Big, 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 big. Ooh, and a sandhawk too. That's not bad. We don't have a B, though. No B. The whole run, it gave me everything in the game, but no B. Oh, dear. Neptune, we're gonna die. No, we're, we're gonna die. I, I barely, I feel like we're barely holding on as it is. Now we gotta fight this. Ozo. Yeah, I'm back. I'm back. Don't worry about that. That's two second wins in a row. I gotta be really careful now. Uh-oh. I'm still back. Okay, let me go. Actually, let me actually go chill out. Did I, did I slap on mouthwash? I think I might have. Yeah, I need to get up. If I don't get up here and start defending myself, I'm probably just gonna die. Got some nades out. I just can't use anything that's gonna kill me. Here we go. You're gone. Good, 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 good. I think I actually will use this Pyrex candy. Try to clear out the stage a little bit. I have close enough. Okay. 
They appear. And they disappear. Woo! Let's go. We survive. Oh, we survive. And we are going to shoot televisions as well. We still got more. We still got more gear to get. Let's shoot, let's shoot up some televisions, yeah? One right there. I can get over there. Right there. Thank you. And run down here. Too many shots it would take to hit it from this from right here. I guess it's not worth it. I'm gonna sprint over there. Now very carefully now. Shoot that TV that's sitting right there. Okay. It's dead. It's gone. Gosh, this butcher keeps wanting to put ammo back in the magazine. Hyperion, yeah. Cool. So now we got all the TVs demolished. We can just take the bridge straight across. And not worry about dying unless we fall. Alright, let's see. TDR Plasma Caster. TDR Plasma Caster. Alright, let's go. We're getting close to that dragon fight. Oh, my cheats. <laughs> Legendary Roboteer. Take one. Let's head out. Here we go. The Badlands. Let's light mill of this guy. What's your answer? I, 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 I'm just wondering what your answer is. Didn't think you had one anyway. So easy nowadays, and that's that's with what? No, seriously, that's with what? Mouthwash on? Like, come on. Maybe let's put a little bit of max HP healing on there. All right, Ethereal gift box. What do you got for me? I already have a twin hornet. I'm not going to use you. Baby maker goes against the rules of anarchy, so I guess a doobie is what it is. Doobie, let's head out. It's time for El Dragon fight after the horde round. Alright, maybe a butcher would be fun here. Yeah, I think a butcher would be kind of fun here. Good, good, good. It's recoils so with kind of a lot though. Good. Good work, good work, good work. 14 out of 30. Oh, yeah. The ricochets. All right. 400 stacks. I think that might be what I'm allowed. Oh, my gosh. I can't. I can't shoot a thing. Okay. So, we need to make our... Grab our token. Make our sacrifice. And we're going to have to get lucky here. A grog nozzle for the lads. For los boyos. Okay, a couple grog nozzles. I was getting worried. Let's grab one. Ooh, max health and sniper max ammo? Yeah, I think we take that. Okay, here we go. It is time for the, the culminating event. Talk to you. You shield me. Yeah, I could use it. What is it? Thank you. The bada boom, which is nice. I could hit anything with it. Can I hit the? Can I hit the box one more time, right? No, it's. I thought it was supposed to be seventy-five iridium, but it's hundred. Okay, no iridium though. So let's 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 think about what we want to do here. I want to think about this for a second, because. I don't know how we're going to... I think Neo Generator is probably the best. Probably the best here with a magic missile to boot to, to, to couple with it. I think we go... I think we go this build, but we're going to have to use something to bring it down. And I think the Grog Nozzle has to, has to be equipped. Death Trap's going to have a lot to say about who comes down and who doesn't. But depending on who comes down, we're going to have to switch up our tactics, but... 
Ooh, here we go. It's time for the dragon fight. This is the the hardest part of Roguelands. It's, it's the part that separates the puny vault hunters from the big scary vault hunters. So let's do this. 400 stacks of anarchy. Mouthwash, toothpick. Hopefully the dragons go on him first. Um, looks like we are gonna get our worst our worst fears realized here, and the the fire dragon's gonna come down first. So just just keep out our grog nozzle and get ready to try to burst this guy down. That's pretty good damage. Actually, really good damage. Incinerator's down. Cool. Yeah, trap. You bring down anybody you want. Anybody you want. Oh, you want to bring down blue? Fine. I'll take out blue. I'll do whatever you want, buddy. Okay, let's toss a grenade. Yelanth is going to die here. Okay, okay, then down down the two. Tag somebody else for me. You tagging. Purple? Cool. Boost is definitely going down here. 400 stacks of anarchy. There's a lot of stacks of anarchy. There we go. One magazine at a time here. Yes! Now it's just green. I mean, the... Toothpick is doing a phenomenal job. I think the nth degree is also doing a great job at bringing down more uh, more dragons for me to shoot at. Okay, this is it. Let's go. All right, we, we are going to take our build and we are going to go challenge the secret final raid boss. Let's go. That's a win. That's an absolute win in the books. Let's go. We're going we're gonna to update that scoreboard up there. We're going to give that, that scoreboard a little update. First... The fireworks. Sick. All right. A hive is absolutely what we are looking for going into the next fight. That looks like a North Fleet. Let's grab another hive, apparently. We are looking for a bee shield. A sheriff's badge could be good. Looking for a bee shield. If we can find one. What is that? Slaga. More slagas. More hives. That's crazy. What I would like is a B shield. I don't. I don't think it's the unkept herald that we want. We'll go chain lightning though. Chain lightning plus my grog nozzle should be good enough healing. But no B shield's a little bit tough. Nirvana's not going to get the job done. I think we're probably going to end up going hive. Then. So many good weapons here. I'm trying to keep my eyes out for a B shield. There's one. Cool. Okay, so we should be able to keep up the B shield, do mouthwash, do toothpick, and and beat this beat this final boss. Hopefully we can get this job done. Gage is pretty sick because she can have Death Trap go tank for her while she does B-Shield shenanigans. Is my, do I not have it on? Oh, I do. So while I do B-Shield shenanigans, Death Trap can tank for me. And I can just try to juice up 400 stacks of anarchy with a B-Shield. The accuracy. Uncanny. Okay, last one. There we go. Actually, getting by these first couple guys is actually going to be the hardest part, to be honest. Don't take damage from them. Don't take damage. Don't take damage. Oh! I'm better than you. Because my accuracy isn't going to matter so much against the big laddie. It's going to matter a lot more against these small laddies. Okay, here we go. By the way, before we start this fight, I'm putting the check mark up there. Okay, so now that's fixed. We can head on out. 
The final challenge awaits us. All right, Death Trap, you get out here. I need you to go tag the boss. I, I, I need you to go tag the boss, buddy. Thank you. Uh oh. Not working. Ow, 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 ow. Well, <laughs> yeah, don't use the bada boom, apparently. Don't use anything I'm using. I learned. Yeah, we ended up putting ourselves down. It's a good thing that I don't consider this as part of the actual run. No shot, no way, no chance. <laughs> end up shooting ourselves down to bits. But hey, we had a great time. Thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And I will see you all in the next one. Let's go. Thank you.